All right, welcome back to a special edition of Shakas and Shoutouts. Now, on Monday, when we received the news that media legend Emmy Tamingbang passed away at the age of 73, we were all immediately saddened. Yes, and she was a wahine we all grew up watching on TV, a Filipino icon, the definition of class, and the embodiment of aloha. And so we invited Rikud Galuteria. This is one of Emmy's childhood friends and the host of Kupuna Power, which airs right here on KITV and KITV. KU to share some fond memories of her. Aloha, Rick. How are you? I'm fine. Emmy would just love to be on the backside listening to you folks talk. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she would just love that right now. <laughs> but yeah, we miss her. Emmeline. Emmeline to Mimbang. Emmeline. Yeah. So you guys both were Kakaako kids. Yeah, Kakaako kids. And, um, you know, Emmy was a little older than I, but with the Galuteri house, uh, to Mimbangs used to live on Ohe Street and uh, uh, Galuteria is on Ilalu Street, so that was in the same, that's where Kakaku Gateway Park is now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so Emmy used to come over to, because she didn't have brothers and sisters, right? So the Galuteria kids would always take her in, and yeah. I, and I was watching a little bit of the clip, because you sent uh, 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 the episodes, so we could kind of preview it, and you guys talked about that neighborhood being, having the dump, and how she would go and go yeah. grab stuff from the dump, that's amazing. Yeah, we were there, and then it was the police uh, firing range, and then the dump, and then Point Penix. <laughs> That was a whole lineup right and there. And now it's a what? It's a park. That's the park. Now it's a park, and but you still have the kakaako fragrance going on <laughs> every afternoon. <laughs> what that is is that's a methane gas from you know the because the dump is reclaimed right, land, right? Land so the methane gas underneath still comes oh. up. That's the, that's the fragrance <laughs> of kakaako. Yeah. But uh, Emmy and I would talk about that all the time. Yeah, you know, Uncle, back then, did you like both have any ideas that you guys would be both doing incredible things in the in the media industry? No, we had other plans for each other. <laughs> she would always say, you know, I changed your diaper. I don't know, too much information. Come on. And then or now? Oh, yeah. <laughs> You guys have a special edition of Kupuna Power that airs tomorrow night. Yeah. It's a previously taped show in which yeah. you and Kimo Kahuano yeah. sit down with Emmy to reminisce about the old days. And in it, Emmy shares why she left news to create her own show. Watch this. So I continued, um, but you know, I went from TV news, is that the one you're asking me? TV news to my own company, because I got tired of doing features for like a minute and 30 seconds after spending all day. And you know, it just didn't seem fair. So I said, I'm getting out of this, I can have a longer show and give more time to these people and their wonderful stories. So that's how I started Island Moments. I love that. You you know, she was literally speaking about this show. Yeah. Mm. This is exactly what we went through in, in radio, and we wanted to be able to tell those stories and get mm -hmm. a little bit more deeper into those stories. So we really do, all three of us, owe our, our careers to this incredible pioneer. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, and, and not only the three of you, but I mean, you, you have thanks and gratitude coming from people like your own Diana Cole. Yes. Mm -hmm. And all of the Wahini uh, mm -hmm. yes. you know, broadcasters throughout the years, and so, that, so Tomorrow, uh, we are going to honor her by re-airing, and we're going to encore her show. Oh, that's and awesome. I, I want to invite everybody at 7 o'clock right here on KITV. 7 o'clock on KITV and then 6.30 on KIKU. So you got like that Kupuna Power Hour, yeah. as you mentioned earlier. So it's a new show at 7 o'clock, and then one week later, it's the rerun of, you know, at 6.30. Yeah, so we'll get to see Emmy twice in one week. I nice. love that. Awesome. Yeah. What we would recommend is uh, to set your DVR already so you can watch this show. It's amazing. And of course, to see the Aloha Morning Show back in action. Oh, we talk about how we honored Emmy, right? We followed in her footsteps and mm -hmm. doing the work that we do. And we also follow in the footsteps of you and Uncle Kimo because you guys are the pioneers of radio and all of us three been in radio for 30 plus years too. So yeah. thank you. Oh, we, we, we're in the unks category. Yes. <laughs> I, I told him to grow this one. I said, you know what I'm going to say? I'm going to say he is Hawaii's uncle. And I told him, don't do it. He's going to get mad. Yes, yes, and he did it anyway. Oh, oh, I, I want to thank the Academy. 